This is great. <laughs> this is hilarious. Whether you like Trump or not, this is hilarious. <laughs> Look what he made all these people do. We are watching the Trump car and truck parade in McKinleyville, California. Yes, seriously. this was happening on Facebook and I just had to get it on video. <laughs> it seems that one of the vehicles is playing an interesting song about Donald Trump. <laughs> Do I look like I'm dressed appropriately to go to a Donald Trump rally? I tried to put on the most red, white, and blue clothes that I could find. I also brought a red, white, and blue face mask in case anyone gets too close to me. There it is. It's a very beepy truck parade, isn't it? My phone might die before I finish recording this parade because I just recently read a Facebook post that this parade is about 500 vehicles long. And my phone is about to die. There's a little pro-Biden, pro-Black Lives Matter counter-protest, like, a few blocks that way. As well as people who have apparently come out in support of Trump. Oh my gosh, look, Trump's in the backseat of the car.
people could be beeping in protest of Trump or in support of him. Honestly, I can't really tell. I just hear cars just beeping madly. And look, they're still coming. And my phone is still recording, surprisingly. Somebody who knows, please tell me what that song was. All I heard was the N-word repeatedly and references to Donald Trump. all these people do. Look, my boyfriend's coming back after taking our children through the McDonald's drive through They were hungry. On the internet, it said these cars would be turning around in front of the old Kmart. I should have went where? Why? This lady in front of me was yelling at everybody. So loud, she was yelling, bitches! Oh! At the people that were in the Trump rally, like, oh my bitches. god. Please don't say that word again. I don't want my children repeating it. Although I'm sure they've heard worse in the last few minutes. You wouldn't believe what I heard people yelling and got on video. Wait, did you get food for me or just for them? Oh, he can't even hear me over all the honking and the sound of his engine. <gasps> Look at this. That's a nice looking classic car right there. keep coming. So many of them. There really are hundreds. The Facebook post was telling the truth. Look, they're still coming into McKinleyville.
Oh. Look at these. I will be giving an award to the coolest looking vehicle in this truck parade. Your vehicle will be in the thumbnail image of this video on YouTube. Look, some kind of family has stopped on the other side of the road to wave at and encourage the truck people in nice dresses. Meanwhile, the person who lives in the house behind those trees is just waking up, wondering why they're hearing all this beeping. <laughs> I may be joking, but I wouldn't be surprised if numerous people in McKinleyville found out about this event today because they heard the massive amount of beeping. <laughs> Look, they're still coming. They're coming. They're coming. And beeping. The vehicles are now beginning to go the other way. I'm not sure where they ended up turning around, but it was not in front of the old Kmart. As you can see, there is nobody there. But they are turning around somewhere, as you can see. Anyway, people, I am not going to just stand here for another hour and keep recording these cars coming. We are in fact going to get in the line of cars and drive with them for a little while because they're going the way that we need to go to get home with all this wood on top of our car. People can just look at us and wonder if we're Trump supporters or not, because like we have dreadlocks, but I'm wearing red, white, and blue. He's wearing camo. And we've got like redneck looking wood on top of our car. <laughs> we are now- I smell exhaust. In the Trump parade for just a second. Hi. The funniest thing happened seconds after I stopped recording, of course, when we were racing down Central Avenue in McKinleyville and passing all the truck trucks on the right, and my boyfriend was kind of sarcastically yelling, Trump, Trump. I looked over seconds after I stopped recording, and someone was standing on the sidewalk recording us. So I might be in somebody else's YouTube video or even on the news, riding with my car covered in wood with my boyfriend appearing to scream in support of Donald Trump. I hope people will wonder if we drove all the way from Fortuna to McKinleyville with that wood on our car in support of Trump. Because I'm sure that's what some of them thought when they saw us. And that 
is hilarious. <laughs> so whether you vote for Trump, who I don't like very much, or Joe Biden, who I don't like very much this year, please at least vote for somebody. As I honestly couldn't in good conscience tell anyone to vote for either Trump or Biden. At least not because I think that either of them are great people. But in America, there's this saying that when you vote, you're supposed to pick the lesser of two evils because both candidates are usually so evil that you can't pick a good one. You just have to pick the least evil one. And supporters of both Trump and Biden are going to be horribly offended by what I just said. So now that I have said it, I'm going to end this video. Please like this video, share this video, watch my other videos, and subscribe to my channel. And if you would like to help me to make more videos, you can by donating money to me on Patreon or other sites, or buying things for me or my family or my pets off of Amazon or other sites. Thanks for watching this video. Bye, people.